migrated uh, from a war torn Iraq uh, back in 2005. I uh, grew up here, came here at a very young age, uh, did my high school at Fairfield High School. And while I was at school, I was always taking part into community initiatives that give back and contribute to this great country of ours, Australia. Uh, at the age of 15, I was uh, a volunteer at a, an environmental committee uh, with Fairfield City Council. Um, I love the environment um, and, I, and I care about um, um, our parks, our creeks, and uh, we always uh, want uh, to see uh, Australia uh, green like we always do. So I took part in that committee at a very young age. I was the, the youngest person there. Um, and since then I have volunteered for almost uh, 20 organizations, um, both uh, local and also around Sydney. Um, I was the Young Citizen of the E. I was awarded that because uh, Fairfield City Council uh, saw my contributions uh, and saw what I've done uh, in that city. So they decided to award me the Young Citizen of the Year. And uh, a year after that, I uh, was given the Australia Day Medal uh, for my community work. Uh, I've done all sorts of things, uh, from being a volunteer uh, for uh, a couple of days to uh, being a coordinator uh, with the Salvation Army for their Red Shield appeal. Um, I've worked with charities. I love charity work uh, because th through these charities, we are able to uh, help the needy in our community. Most people remember me as a teacher because I was a teacher for five and a half years. So I taught English to speakers of other languages, which was a very rewarding uh, career for me because I was able to, uh, to make uh, the journey of so many migrants uh, uh, to Australia easier. A day like Australia Day reminds us that we all came uh, from all walks of life to this new land. Uh, we have to protect it, we have to look after it, and uh, thanks God that I was able uh, to feel like I'm blessed that I'm Australian, I'm blessed to come to this land.